And joining me now is Minister Al Rumi from Oman, the Energy Minister from Oman. Thank you so much for joining us. Now, tell us, it's been low price environment for probably a little bit longer than people would have preferred. How are, th how are you coping in Oman at the moment? We're okay. We are, we are coping with difficulties. It's painful, but um, we have no option, really, yeah, but just to keep going. And again, I mean, is it really, have you all just put in place better efficiencies? I mean, it's, you have to be resilient in this market. You actually, as you said, you, you have no choice. You have to keep going. So, but I mean, what, what have you put in place to actually make sure that you can survive? I think we've done with what everybody else is doing, uh, as you've mentioned, efficiency, cost cutting, uh, doing things uh, or doing more for less. And uh, it's, it's working. Uh, plus our other sectors outside the oil and gas are also chipping in. So we're spending less uh, in other sectors, or we are sort of removing the fat in the whole economy of the country. Mm, so. how, how quickly, just um, tell me, how optimistic are you about OPEC? You've been talking about the fact that you even said that common sense is prevailing there. And it's, it's, it's um, again, these are your friends, your old friends from a long time now. But are you optimistic that now that everybody is talking OPEC and non-OPEC, that everyone's coming back to the table? This is good. I think so. I think so. For the first time, we see even head of states making a positive statement uh, in regard to the production, production levels, uh, all the ideas of freezing or cutting production. We, we had statement from the president of Russia, Mr. Putin, the president of Iran, I think, endorsed uh, this, uh, this concept. So I'm, I'm extremely optimistic. Uh. Now, a lot of investment has been taken off the market. How important is it, and we're hearing it throughout the conference today here too, that more investment needs to go back into the oil sector because, um, you know, you look at the energy demands to the future and investment must go back into this industry. I think uh, if, I, if I speak on behalf of the NOCs, the investment has not been too bad. Huh? We have continued with the same cause as we were before. I'm a bit concerned about the IOCs. IOCs, they tend to look at... Uh, the, the share prices, the, the pleasing the shareholders. Uh, we have a much longer, longer as Minister of UAE said, uh, the investment here has, has, uh, has been going on, uh, so, sort of business as usual. So are we in, in Oman and in other, in other IO, uh, NOC controlled uh, oil sector. So I think, I think we are not doing too bad in terms of investment. Globally, yes, we are concerned that there have been a cut in investment and this may hurt us in in the near future.